Bam. Hello, everybody. This is going to be a fun, fun day because I am going to simulate all of SummerSlam. And I mean all of SummerSlam from the pre-show to the end. All of it. I got the card here. I got everything ready. So let's start things off the pre-show. Of course, you're not using a ring because I don't have time for ring. Yay, no time for rings. Yay, I have to set up an entire new thing for this. Well, we start things off in a pre-show for the United States title. Santino versus Antaro versus Antonio Cesaro. Here you go. Part one. Woo! Match one of I don't know eight. This is the SummerSlam simulation. Part one of eight. Eight matches, yeah. I'm gonna simulate SummerSlam, TJ. Woo! Here comes Antonio Cesaro. Woo! Audio Casanoli, I mean what? <laughs> that gimmick does not exist. God, so many bright flashing lights. So many bright flashing lights for Antonio Cesaro. It is opponent, the United States Champion. Santino Morella. I picked the brightest arena I could find, Sean. This is the best idea ever. <laughs> it won't be bright after the intros. This is a US title match simulation. Who's going to win will be Cesaro or will be Santino Morella. And before Santino hits the Cobra, which I think is in this game somehow. Belly belly suplex. You're not winning anything, Burke. You're not even in this match. I am simulating SummerSlam for hilarity. No, it's not. It is not. It's SummerSlam simulation. Maybe before TCW leaves. I'll get them done before two weeks, don't worry. I was going to do them, in fact, uh, next week, probably. Thursday, maybe. Get them all done right then and there. 200 times speed. Okay. He blamed me? I mean, we had a whole bunch of crazy things that happened that caused craziness. One count by Santino. Santino versus Antonio Cesaro. Oh, did you just come in just to call me a slacker? Oi, I promised I'd do this to someone, so you be quiet. John, is Josh now Duke Dice? Seriously, do you have to use Duke Dice's catchphrase? The chat's distracting me now. Because it's crazy. 
Where are you, Chaos Razor in disguise, Josh Key? Level to the face of Santino. Jumping over to the face. Boston Crab! Or is that a Swiss Crab? I didn't know anymore. Giant swing! Okay. After this, I will do my qualifiers. Are you happy, Raji? Are you happy? Pinfall by Santino. One. Count. But I'm doing them in order of what you gave me due to the random simulator. There will be no picking. There will be no picking by anyone. Headlock. Since why is see, you know, this is what you get for imitating Duke, Josh. This is what you get. This is what you get. Now he's in the channel. Repeated punches and down goes Antonio. This game is making Santino look good in the ring. <laughs> European uppercut. Giant swing. I think a lot of people love me because I'm apparently playing Fire for Returns. People want to watch, apparently. There goes Santino. Santino actually looking okay. Big boots in the face. Never mind. Cobra? Is it Cobra time? That doesn't look like a Cobra, that's like a jumping forearm. That looks more like a Cobra spinning chop to the face or whatever. Back floor! Punches to the face and down goes Antonio Cesaro. Crossbody! Billy to Billy, side slam, and giant swing. Headlock. Necklock, yay, look at the necklock. Yeah, I'm still waiting for the moment Craig Angle shows up and screws over CM Punk for some odd reason. I have a bunch of simulations to do! Double drop! Wait, maybe I should do all my Key of the Ring qualifiers at 800 times the speed. Maybe I should. 800 times speed? Simulations? Okay, I'll do that after SummerSlam! Simulations. 14. Come on. And dead. Come on, be dead. 2.9. Belly to belly side slam. Someone get this over with. Is Cesar actually going to win the United States Championship? Boot to the back! SummerSlam simulations! Because it's tomorrow! Couple to the back. And Tino gets dead! Dead Santino, dead! One, two! 2.9! No, Santino beats out twice out of a move that I thought, oh no! 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 He- What? You're- You're- You're too far away from- him. No! <laughs> best glitch ever! Best Cobra! Best Cobra glitch ever! Oh, wow. Wow, I- I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry, that was the best glitch ever for that. I think uh, Santino has to win this. <coughs> Santino just missed completely. Better to belly suplex. Dude coming in saying board game online, how dare you? I should mute you, you jerk. No. Santino to the world side slam and then it's 18. Someone gonna go for a pin in this match. Roll up by Santino. Legit not there. Submission again! Uh, crappy audio. Why do you fail me, Explitch? Sent you to put in the corner turn my goal. Uh oh, he's gonna do it again. He's gonna clip off and not be able to do it. Look at this. He's off! He's off! Again! He does this again! He's off! Look at this! Look at that! He's... Invisible Cobra! Invisible Worm! Invisible Worm and it worked. That's ultra selling right there from Antonio. Does it not once but twice? I am just... Can't believe he's doing it twice. Antonio... Dropping Santino on his head and everywhere else. Duke! You suck. <laughs> no. Duke, you can't get over it. What are you talking? <laughs> and. And turn. Everyone's outside the ring. Awesome. Kick to the face! Shh, I'm watching SummerSlam. Shh, I'm watching better than SummerSlam right now. Mildly enjoyable. And he has someone to come on. What is he, Archangel? Backdrop. Stop to the back. What am I? I'm everybody's entertainment for the day, it seems. Or at least for the number of hours I'm gonna cast. And dropped. And picked up and dropped again. No, wait. Now he's dropped. Pin! Pin him! Two! Three! There! Your new United States Champion! Antonio Cesaro. They have Fire Pro is right at all. Because I'm too lazy to start modding people. If you want my last opinion. Right now. I've got shows to book. And second match. If I could find the idiot that is supposed to be on this list. There he is. And the person who he faces, who's going to be obviously this guy. We match two. We match two. Match two. Well, Brock is in the main event. We'll find out in about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven matches. Hey, it's not gonna be that long. It's only gonna be like an an hour, maybe. Yeah. Depends on who gets squashed and who doesn't.
And it's the Miz. Miz. Uh. Well, I will be casting for a long time. It's supposed to be this. It's going to be Implosion King of the Ring qualifiers at 800 speed. Then it's going to be either Tony Hawk, Ultimate Muscle, or some other stuff. I will let people vote. I will. For your enjoyment. I'm Jake by Ray. Miz and Ray Mysterio, this is gonna be great. SummerSlam simulations, yay! Just do the 619 already, you know we know you're going to. Take it down, close line. Hit with a punch in the face. Arm dragged. Drop kick to the back of the head. And the Miz turn to do stuff. Miz gets to do stuff. What a what a match. You know what I'm surprised that I couldn't find in the card that I really wanted to see? I really wanted to see Sandow and Clay. Damien Sandow and Cordis Clay face each other in a match. Because I really thought Damien Sandow would end Cordis Clay's dancing career in a series of chop block accidents. Or, you know, assaults. Rana Pin! One count. Tommy had to close Skype to save space, actually. It's true. Back body drop. Tommy never uses Skype when he's on XSplit. Because the last time he tried to use XSplit and uh, cast at the same time, he had a little bit of errors. I know it's not on there, but I want to see it on there. I wanted to see... Oh, I should not call TJ. Face Buster! Jawbreaker. Face Buster again. Unfortunately, you will not see Ray vs. Sin Cara, at least not right now, because this is Sim SummerSlam, and SummerSlam does not like the book Ray vs. Sin Cara for the mask of Ray Mysterio. <laughs> well, I said for the mask of Ray Mysterio. I wish they would book for the mask of Ray Mysterio. Side slam. And there's that frickin' STO and a pin, yay. Where's that? Yeah. I'm waiting- Oh! Ray! Ray being a ninja! Trying to recapture some WCW glories. Actually doing high-risk moves. Aw, oh, Miz. Miz, trying to go for Skull Crushing Finale, missed it completely. I drop! Stop to the face! Back grapple! Discus Lariat, fine, that works, now go for back grapple. Never mind, two in a row, apparently. Run a pin! 
No, two counts. Big knee to the face. Stop to the leg. Kick to the thigh, whatever. Miz! Big knee, now go after Ray. Drop kicks! Ray thinking it's 1999. Lot of pin by Ray again. One, two, two count. No, nothing for you, Ray. Another Marana pin. One, two, two count. There we go, school crushing finale. Come on, just end the match. Oh my god, Ray kicked out. What the hell? Face buster, dro Ray dropped on his head. Drop kicked to the knee. Ray getting stuffed in the face. Snap suplex by Miz. You know, is it just because Burke's first post that he made? I mean, you know, chat that he makes has to be uh, corrected by himself. Ray Mysterio! Run up in! What is the deal with all these Rana pins by one Ray Mysterio? Small package, Miz. Much of those. Ha! <laughs> Dragging the head against the ropes, that's awesome. Now troll him. Rana pin will break. Too close to the ropes. Jawbreaker by Ray because Ray doesn't know what he's doing. Big splash. Rope break again. Drop kick misses. Does Zavala get pinned to be in the face buster actually? And then a pin by the face buster. One, two, two point nine. Face buster again. Pinfall. One, two, three, two point nine. Miz is putting the corner turnbuckle. Tornado DDT. Both men run into each other. Rana pin, but no, Rana, just not a Rana pin. I keep seeing Rana pins for some odd reason. Oh no, Miz, you're not going to, are you? Crossbody to the outside. What the hell, Miz? Miz, no! Dropped on his head. You see the skull crunching finale now, or are you gonna wait again? Chop block. Oh, great. Here comes Ray again. Pinfall action. Nope. Rope break. Good job. Drop kick misses. School crusher finale. Silver. One. Two. Three. The Miz retains. The Miz retains. Anyone shocked? School crusher finale. Oh, this match is next. It's gonna be fun. Okay. Time for a tag match, play us. Time for a tag match. Tag match, play us. Tag match, play us. Who booked the tag match? It was not me. It was Sonic Chrono booked the tag team match.
It's all your fault, Sonic Chrono. All your fault. Yeah. You're the you're Teddy Long. It's your fault. You put the tag match play. Tag match play. Introducing first the primetime players. Darren Young and Titus O'Neil both wearing pink. Is that enough pink for you guys? I can feel more pink. And their opponents. R Truth and Kofi Kingston, undisputed tech team champions. Jeez. I don't know. Hi Kofi. Hi R Truth. Oh look, it's me, Darren Young and R Truth fighting in the ring. The Black John Cena versus wait. Yeah, John Cena call him the Black John Cena now. <laughs> Suplex. True, what are you gonna do, true? Dropping to the face, and I'm just gonna say this right now. Um, <clears throat> uh, notice that the tag team match is well, I'm not gonna say anymore, but this is the only match really of one. This is the only match that a that a <laughs> it's the only match that involves black people. I think uh, WWE might be a bit racist here. Then again, uh, Mark Henry kind of, you know, Mark Henry being the main eventer up close to actually wrestling. Not matching. He's still an injured reserve, isn't he, Mark Henry? Drag away from the ring. You know the ring at least. Punch in the face! And... Titus O'Neil gets put into... And it gets put in the corner again! Titus just keeps getting put in the corner. I like this match. Drop you to the face! I do like... This match, and uh, I am disappointed though that WWE hasn't really done any uh, 2v2v2v2, two v two v two v two, you know, four teams competing for the titles or whatever, or title shot. You remember that one Texas Tornado thing that Crime Time won for the number one tearship with the tag team titles, and then they never got a title shot ever? Yeah, I wish they'd do more of those, but actually give away the title shot. Like, let it happen. Yes, I just talked about Crime Time. They had like two title shots that they never got. Nope. 
Oh, that might just be because primetime players aren't as good as they're advertised. Maybe, I don't know. Drop kick. It might have been because the save was made, or oh, I don't know, was it? It was before the big push to the main event that, I mean, a big push to the tag team high spot they're at. It was when they were tagging and they hadn't exactly had Washington yet. Backslide. One count. See only gets a one count there, you know? You know what this tag team needs? And Vince probably thinks this. It needs Ezekiel. Nice DVT into the neck breaker there by Kofi and a drop kick to the face. Awesome. That's like six of them. Roll up. Rope break. Kaius O'Neal obviously just waiting for an opportunity now. There's that DVT again. Off the ropes. Baseball slide to the face. And tag. Kaius is in. I just punches Kofi in the face and then gets nothing. Kofi's like, hey. And attempts to imitate the miss with skull crushing finale. And then kicks the hell out of Titus and then kicks nope. Imitates the Miz again. There's the kick to the face again. Different one this time, but it's still face. Another Leg to the back of the head. Kofi's clapping. And the entire crowd was clapping too. Kofi! Sleeper to me to the face. What? Kofi and Titus, no. Titus putting the turnbuckle and uh-oh. Nice move there by Kofi. And the DT again. Backside by Kofi. One, two, broken up by Darren Young. Obviously both of them are just doing nothing. Darren Young gets hit in the back of the head. Tyrus gets dropped. Tyrus again gets DDT'd. Pinfall, rope break. Kofi can get the pin on someone, it can be over pretty quickly. Three out of eight. So we're almost halfway there. Tossed over his head. Hi, so Neo Kofi kicks in the middle of the ring. And here comes our truth. Apparently having the same hair as Booker T of Yep, SummerSlam prediction matches. Dancing by our truth! Yay! Dancing! <laughs> Our truth <laughs> Suplex stutter. I don't really. Axe kick. Hip flap, axe kick, rope break. I'm gonna be honest. This has went three ma- and this is the third match and uh, I'm still shocked that uh... Well, I'm not really shocked, I'm just shocked that uh... The save had the most wearing pink and... Pink name tags. I think that's pink on pink. This axe kick. Axe kick again. Away from the ropes this time. Pinfall by 
by far truth one count only. Way too close to the ropes. Our truth pulls up. Titus O'Neil. <laughs> it's over. It's over. Wow. Wow. There's more dancing by our truth. Amazing. Amazing. Way to dance, our truth. Way to dance. Okay. Okay. Now that that's done, it's time to throw in the random world title match that's like halfway through the card. You know what I mean. And the title match that's most likely to be halfway through the card is the one that does not involve John Cena. So, without further ado, I give you the world title match that is, that is going to go on first. Because it doesn't have John Cena. Well, you're in the right place, because after this, we're going to have the Implosion King of the Ring qualifying matches. But it's going to be super fast, 800 times speed. It's going to go out, boom, 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 boom. And you're not going to be able to tell what the heck's going on. It's going to be cool, and here's Alberto Del Rio! Alberto Del Rio! There's a lot of light. And his opponent, the World Heavyweight Champion! The man who apparent, who I think either should be a spokesperson for Mayonnaise or... I don't know what else to say. It sounds like... Here's Seamus. Here's Seamus. Mayonnaise. It's not my fault that it's a Japanese game. Wait. Chop. Elbow to the face. Sheamus versus Alberto Del Rio. This is going to be the title match that I believe will be first, because I will first world title match, because Cena obviously does not want to be in the mid-car, in the mid-level match. By the way, I'm just going to clarify the trip, the three-man match is a triple threat, right? It's not an elimination match. I mean, I know that's rare that WWE actually ever does an elimination match. But, I just want to make 100% sure that it's triple threat and not elimination. Whoa. Yeah, Alberto Del Rio was better when he was, uh, Sin Card. I mean, not Sin Card, but, uh, Das Karras Jr. Sorry. I have Sin Cara on the mind because uh, Sin Cara is not in this pay-per-view card and he's not facing Grand Mysterio and he's not being Poopy McDo. Poopy McDo! He's Flippy McDo. Barwood, well, if you want <laughs> any more gold commentary, because it's going to YouTube, and I think if you people don't know that I run TCW Implosion, and it's on YouTube on my YouTube channel, it might be on TCW YouTube channel as well. If everything goes out right, it'll be archived on two channels. I don't know, it's all Raji's fault. <laughs> it's all Raji's idea. Hey, Seamus! 
The YouTube, yes, the YouTube is the, is the official thing. Look, I'm not getting paid enough to be coherent. In fact, I'm not getting paid at all. She's so white. Seamus, into the turnbuckle. Punches to the head of Alberto Del Rio, Das Karras Jr. Not wearing enough of a mask. See, I think Alberto Del Rio could be more over with a mask. <laughs> it makes so much sense. I mean, you want Seamus to get over, give him a mask. It, anyone can get over a mask. It'll work, trust me. Belly to belly super. Mask equals over. Back by a drop from Seamus. And then pump handle slam. And then a taunt. And then a big boot to the head. Face. Not a bro kick though, because a bro kick is different. Just a big boot. Sorry guys. It's not, easy. It's not that easy to get a bro kick. Side two puts. And... Was that a bro kick by... Was that a bro kick by Alberto Del Rio? Did he just mock Shavis his own bro kick? Double arm suplex. <laughs> Tell Alberto just mock Sheamus. Pump <laughs> handle <laughs> slam. <laughs> Marriott. Oh wow, Alberto the real just pissed off Sheamus, I think. With the pump handle slams. Uh, the curry misses. Oh wow. Big Larry from Sheamus. Uh, oh no, he's gonna do it. Oh, he pump red pump. Red Pump, we can't have a WWE page without a Red Pump. Oh, Red Pump happens. There's a bro kick. Hit off the bro kick. One, two, two counts. Wow. Big boot to the head again. <laughs> Help for to the Rio they put in the turnbuckle. And kick, and kick. Arm drag. Good ability suplex and Seamus is Seamus getting a breather. There is no over! Is that backbreaker slam and then one, two, two counts. Backbreaker and submission. Great. I'm pretty sure there's a certain number of people in Japan that also did the bro kick, but, uh, yeah. Oh. Release German. That makes much sense. Seamus gets up. Well, Japanese. I mean, there's... I'm telling you, Japan... Man created a lot of moves. I'm gonna say that right now. Japan created a lot of moves. And there's an atomic drop. Right on his butt. And Alberto's like, screw that power driver. Out of the ring goes Alberto! Chavis waiting in the middle of the ring. Did he go for bro kick it in this match at 16 seconds? Oh wait, never mind. It's been past that already. And out goes Alberto again! 
Close line. This gets close line. Submission on the outside. Both guys in the ring. Pump handle slam. Off the turnbuckle. Belly to the belly suplex. Uh, Sheamus, pump handle slam again. Is he going to actually whip him to the ropes and go for the bro kick? Bold Nelson suplex. Uh, Bold Nelson slam and then side suplex. That's great. Mexican armbar! Mexican armbar! Backbreaker. And submission again. God! No one's doing anywhere. Lay him down. Drop down. Oh! Nope, we'll break. That super German super went nowhere. Oh, dropped on his back and the pin again, and it's a rope break. Amazing, Sheamus. You guys are having a longer match than you would in at the actual Summer Slam. We're having a long match. You're supposed to let Triple H have the longest match. You're ruining Triple H. You're ruining Triple H. That's gonna get you both fired. You don't have ironclad contracts! No! Mexican armbar! <laughs> wow. This match is lasting a long while. Mexican armbar again! Big Lariat! And atomic drop. You know, if he kind of gets him, if he actually either runs off the ropes or whips it to the ropes, he most likely will go for the blow kick. But instead, he's getting suplexed around a bit. Out of the ring! Out of the ring. There goes up. This is not a Royal Rumble match. You can't win that way, Sheamus. It's a SummerSlam. Mexican arm bar, rope break, tickles the ropes. Oh! Uh, I cross, and a pin! No. Arm drag goes nowhere. Elbowed off! Mexican arm bar again! Rope break! Uh, I'm not gonna say any words to TJ. Lariat. Another Lariat. Bo Nelson slam, and are they gonna finally gonna do? Is he gonna go for it? No, pump handle slam. All the slams and the submission. Alberto taps! Alberto taps! Sheamus wins! Sheamus wins! Yay! <laughs> That's an Irish clover hold, not a Texas one. That's an Irish one. Okay. Now it's time to get serious. Someone needs a little anger management. And I didn't know Kane actually, you know, practiced this kind of thing, but apparently he does. So we might as well get that match underway.
before I start forgetting where all my guys are. For the people! For the people! Daniel Bryan versus Kane! <laughs> wow. One of these guys has immense anger issues. <laughs> Both of these guys have immense anger issues. I don't know how Kane could be qualified at such a thing to be an anger management doc, you know, consultant or whatever the heck he is. Considering the fact that he lit a lot of people on fire and, well, beat the hell out of Shane McMahon like six times. Six times! He did it six times! And he, he lit JR on fire too. Oh well, The O'Brien versus Kane. You know, I'm slightly scared in reality that this match will probably be the shortest match of the entire pay-per-view. I'm just saying. Well, either Daniel's gonna tap out a monster or a monster's gonna get his butt kicked. Wait. Wait, no. Daniel's gonna tap out a monster or he's going to die. Sorry. Those were two of the same results. I don't know how you're beating him in a test of strength at all. Maybe he's screwing with Daniel Bryan? You ever thought that? Maybe he's screwing with him. Hmm. Leg drop to the back of the head. This is what Kane should do. Beat the crap out of Bryan. Kick to the gut. It's working for Kane! He lost the test of straight, but he's kicking him now. It might be the shortest match <laughs> of the pay-per-view. I said that before. Kane! You want like, guess what? I'm still here! That sounds awfully like, uh, I don't know, Great Muda, maybe? I don't know. Except with, uh, Poison Mist and stabbing people with forks and, uh, biting their faces and... Shining Wizard. <laughs> there goes Daniel Bryan with the choke slam. Well, oh, Kane just staring him down. Second choke slam? No. There he is. Headbutt! Submission by Daniel Bryan! Take him down! And followed by Bryan! One! One count only. Sorry, people, you only get to see one count. You know, I only have three more matches after this. Three more matches! Quick roll up by Daniel Bryan! No count! Sorry! Not gonna work. Oh! 
Here, Brian's getting hurt. Kane's obviously very slow, but he's still apparently kicking Brian's face in. Oh! Back. Nope, there's a slam. Just a regular slam. He hit the choke slam early, he just uh, hasn't hit another one. Russian leg sweep reversal by Dale Bryan. Another close line. Picks him up. Drop to a hold reversal by Dale Bryan. More submissions. The same one like six times. Here comes Kane. No. Drop kick misses. Kane's like, I'm gonna break your neck. You know, I would say that probably in an uh, average game, wrestling game, you'd see your finishers right around now. You would, but, uh, this isn't that. Oh! <laughs> Out of the ring. I know what Chaos Razor is going to do. He's going to try to transform in the entirety of the company and try to write it himself. I think his cloning powers are that big. Oh, arm breaker on a chair. You're making you're making Kane angry. You're making him angry. Seriously. You're making him angry. Outside again. There goes Brian. One, two, three, oh! Such a to the head and Daniel Bryan is busted open. Anger management. Anger management. Here's your anger management lesson. Hit to the back of the head. <laughs> He's murdering him. He's murdering him. He's just killing him. He's... Kane's like, Kane doesn't give up. He just... Wow. Wow. Uh... I think Brian might be, uh, concussion. Hey, Brian, do you have a concussion? Why are you saying, uh, CCC? I think Brian now thinks he speaks Spanish. Flipped over by Kane. It's not that bad. If he gets hit one more time in the head, maybe he'll think he speaks French. Wee wee wee. Gotta wait for it. You know, if he quit, he just... Oh! Close line. Elbow to the deck. Yep, one more hit to head and Daniel Bryan becomes Mike Burke. It's totally possible. Or it could be Peyton Lamar, we'll see, yeah, we'll find out. Elbow to the neck. Yeah, 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 yes. And he tries to kick Kane in the face. Kane, obviously, though, no self concussions. One, two, two counts. Dude, you're not gonna beat Kane by trying to show up. Oh! Dead! 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 And Kane's tired out! What? Kane, what the heck? Kane used all his stamina! Kane used all his stamina, he couldn't get the pin! Fisherman Suplex, god dang it! 2.9! This is what happens when you don't get stamina. Slam down. Kane needs to take a breather again. Wow, Kane. Tossed, and Kane needs to take a breather again! You know, maybe you should throw Dale Bright out of the ring and then take a breather yourself. Throw him out of the ring. 
Or I could just take all the dragon suplexes. 2.9. This match went five minutes too long. Kane, what are you doing, Kane? Kane's taking a breather. Oh no, he's charging up for something. He's turning into a Super Saiyan. Wait, that's the wrong guy. Never mind. Drop kick to the back of Daniel Bryan's head. Tosses up and drops him. But he has to end with his finisher! He has to use his finisher! <laughs> he has to use his finisher! Pebble to the face. Oh wow. Uh. Big boot to the head of Daniel Bryan. Finisher man, suplex pen! 2.9. Punched. Does not go down. Hey, yo, Brian. It's side slam. Both men obviously very tired right now. We're around that point where it's getting harder and harder to do anything. Oh! The no lock. I think Brian's going to get hit by the choke slam. Back body drop. <laughs> TV title match. Uh, this is not a title contest. I'm sorry. Oh. Two point nine again. Oh jeez. It's gonna keep going until someone actually wins. Oh! Choking! There! Brian gives up! He got choked to death! There! Submission move ended it! Truthfully, it's 15 minutes because Ring of Honor says 15 minutes is obviously the amount of time the TV title match should take. Okay. Now it's time to actually get to the best match on the card. Yes, the best match on the card. I know everybody's like, yay, best matches. Because everybody wants to see this match. I think. I think everyone wants to see this match. We're going to find out. No! No! We got left this. No, that's the next match. That's the triple threat. And then we have the main event thingy. No, we got two more matches before we get to Triple H and Lesnar, because Triple H and Lesnar is the main event. You know, the only time Cena's not in the main event is when it's Brock Lesnar or Triple H. Just saying. I'm just saying. Or The Rock. Or The Rock. No, he's not. You think he is, but he's not going to be. He's not going to be Triple H. Like, no, me main event. You can believe. You can believe. I'm just saying, in this simulation, he's not the main event. 
Down goes Jericho! Down goes Jericho! Truck told. Da 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 da! Elbow in the face again. How am I gonna book an extreme loss match between Lesnar and Triple H? Again. I think everyone else knows how I'm gonna book that. Time for a death match! Yay! Death match. It's death match time for Lesnar and Triple H at the end of the show. Boom! Down goes Jericho. Drop to hold. I mean, like, yeah, kind of. Tiger spin, whatever. We are down to three matches. And only one of these is, uh, an actual main event. Troll, -lo 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 -lo. Jericho has two characters in WWE 13. It's not about shorts with WWE! You should know that, fella! WWE is not always about what should happen. You remember the great Kali in his title match? Pinfall by Ziggler! One! Two! I had a title ring! I'm the Great Kali! I was world champion once! <laughs> Kali Tom. <laughs> yeah, should that have happened? No, but WWE did it anyway because they thought, hey, it'll be big in India. What they re don't realize is that, you know, without the Great Kali, they'd probably be pulling at least, say, close to the same numbers as they would without with Kali. Just saying. Him. Kick to the back. Honestly, I haven't noticed Takali in any WWE game since 2007 because I haven't cared. Oh. I'm sure Raji and Jarek and everybody else watching is very is in their seats just going like Sam Implosion, King of the Ring qualifying matches, do it, do it. We got three matches left, it won't take that long. Especially the Triple H versus Lesnar match, because that's gonna be a death match and now those are always short. Oh, la, 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 la. in parts. I'm sorry my two parts were cut off. I would have... should have recorded it local. I should have recorded it locally. That's really what I should have done. Brooks is in two parts too! Because he had... fails. Logi, you have way better internet than I do. I'm not really having that high of a, uh, you know. I don't like my internet. At all. I mean, it does its job, but when it comes to casting, it's just so inconsistent sometimes. Drop them his head, pinfall. Nope. Tommy's on 50k. Oh, 56k? I'm not on 56k, no. No, I'm on, uh... 
I'm supposed to be on, uh, cable internet speed, I guess. And the cable internet speed sucks. Well, the speed's good. It's that half the time the router goes like, I'm gonna be a jerk, and go like, no. No, you can't have internet. No. My package! By Jericho! One! Two! Two counts. Bulldog. Like, right now, it's going fine. I have no drop frames. Or anything, really. Jericho into the corner, and Ziggler says, I was gonna do something. Jericho goes, no, puts him in the corner instead, and then decides, I'm gonna kick him in the tree of woe. Punch him in the knee, in fact. In the knee, in the knee. Fist to the knee. Fisting his knee. Knees to the back. Oh, I, w I, I wish I still didn't it because there's probably better routers around here that are, you know, locked. But enough about that, let's just keep going. Suplex! No, dropped on his face again. How many times do people get dropped on the face? Uh, my normal up-down rate is, uh, 5, 15, and B... Well, it's, it's nothing to do with the down-up rate, really. It's... Because we're... It's like, it's like, uh... 15, 17, down, uh, 1.7 up, or so. The only problem is, my router likes to be a dick and self-reset, I think, every so often. I don't know. My company is notorious for being a douche, so, yeah, when it comes to the internet. Oh, we're off by Chris Jericho. One, two, two count. Well, up again by Jericho. One. I mean, schoolboy. 2.9. Schoolboys. In the back. Well, up. One. Two. 2.9 again. Sleeper. Ziggler wins. Ziggler gets over by Sleeper. Ziggler gets over. And the crowd goes boo. All the crowd goes boo. That hate Ziggler. Okay, I want to do this right. Battle Royal, first win. And then we pick the right ring for once. And I pick a good the the spike dome because it's good. I don't do a hundred. I don't don't do a hundred speed. I pick Panther. Because the ref, and I want to do uh, nothing else. Everything else looks fine. Let's get the sucker underway, shall we? Of course, I gotta pick the three wrestlers. Why do I gotta pick wrestlers all the time? Cena and the WWE. First name is John Cena in the WWE roster on Fire Pro Wrestling. Where's Big Show, I wonder? Down a lot. Okay. Boom. Let's get this sucker out of the way, shall we? Punk, Cena, Show. Three, no, not a three-way dance. Triple threat. Triple threat. Triple threat. Uh, Fire Pro Returns, you can have eight people wrestling at once. Not ten, eight. You can also have uh, the referee, so that's technically nine. So nine, including the ref. That bear boy is CM Punk. Punk now fighting Big Show. Cena now fighting Big Show. Everybody take out Big Show because he's the biggest one. It'll make more sense. Do it now. Really, I thought WWE 13 was going to be 6. Not, was, is it really going to be 4? 
That's be a terrible idea if it's gonna be four only. Double suplex on Big Show. Oh, quick pin attempt on Cena. Nothing happens. Troll! Big Show going after Cena. Double team, double drop kick. to the head. Well, arguably the old Madden games are better than new ones. And, uh, let's see what else is better that's older. Uh, the old Sonic games were better than the new ones until Generations, which kind of, Generations is a good game, uh, but, you know, the old ones might be just a bit better still. Mario games, it kind of depends on the games, but they're pretty much even, but there are there were a lot more classics in the old ones. It's kind of the same way for everything. It's get the older ones are usually kind of uh well, still have a lot of value. This game is old too. This game was made when uh 2006, I believe, in Japan. Around SmackDown vs. Raw 2006, so this was like at a time where the wrestling games were pretty much at a high. I mean, still, uh, still at a high level is what I mean. And it was released in America at a low point in wrestling history because it had SmackDown vs. Raw 2008 and TNA Impact, and we know both know how much those games were bad. Everyone knows how much those games were bad. Smackdown vs. Raw 2008 completely screwed up its AI system and ruined cause a little bit, pretty much, with the whole attribute thing, with the whole limited amount of moves you got. Then the TNA Impact game came out. Oh look, we're gonna have a decent story mode, a good story mode, but we're gonna have issues with everything else. <laughs> we're gonna put out a half-made game that really did not improve at all. From the demo that we put out. <laughs> when I played TNA Impact the game, I thought I was playing the demo. If that makes any sense. Anyway, Cena, show, pop, and hit, have a ball to the back. And Cena gets tossed out of the ring. And Punk's coming right after show and gets choke slammed. And Cena goes right after. Big Show to break it up. And an STF's Punk! Big Show! He's knocking Cena off the STF. Everyone's going after everyone, it's genius. Cena's bleeding. I like Cena's bleeding. So after this and the Implosion qualifying matches, which won't take long at all, uh... Anyone have any ideas what I should cast next? Uh, Ultimate Muscle, maybe? Uh... What else do I got here? Let's see, what else do I got here? I got a Splashdown, Ride's Gone Wild. I got a Final Fantasy X. I have Killzone, which I suck at. I have Time Crisis 3. I have, a uh, Smackdown Shut Your Mouth here. Everyone's gonna see, I don't... I have Legends of Wrestling Showdown. Uh, Red Faction. Everyone, I don't know. No one's actually saying anything. You guys are can't. You guys are not deciding good enough. Max Payne, Virtua Fighter, Four Evolution, uh, other places to games. Here comes the pain. Lord of the Rings, Return of the King, uh, Ratchet and Clank, which Tony's played so I can't remember. I do not have Legend of Wrestling Two. I'm sorry, Chucky. I have one and three, but not two. There's 2006 and those years saw three. There's SOCOM and uh, let's see, Golden Commando, Game Day 2001. What the heck am I doing with Game Day games? Do that one. Do that one. Okay. Uh, I have. To be honest, I have all the PlayStation 2 SmackDown games up to 2008, and I don't have 2009, but I have 2010 and 2011. But, honest, uh, I liked Here Comes the Pain, but I like the original SVR. You know, 
I should really just play through uh, the, Sm the SmackDown games from Just Brand all the way to 2007. That would be a good idea. Did a season mode or career mode or whatever. You know, play as the main, play as whatever character I want. Play the jobber character, move my way up the league. Cause I can do a uh, Scotty too haughty and just bring it. Uh, shut your mouth. I could do Maven. Here comes the pain. I could do uh, Hardcore Holly. No wait, he's not in there. Uh, here comes the pain. I could do. Why am I, why am I a character? I have a cop Hardcore Holly, so technically I can do Hardcore Holly. The minute I make a fellow call on every one of your season games. Make a Sean Libby. And play Sean Libby through every season game. Uh hmm. Because me, okay. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We have. I, I still have to fish this and, uh, you know, not just go to sleep on Cena. Big Show suplexes Punk instead of Punk suplexing Big Show. Cena knocks down Big Show, goes for back grapple. Nope. Big Show says no. Cena's down. Punk is down. Big Show says, I'm gonna pick both men up. Gets knocked down. Punk. Is getting double teamed by Cena and Show. Outside of the ring goes Punk. Here comes Big Show. Big Show going after CM Punk. Everyone's on the outside of the ring. Cena attacking Big Show. Cena's still bleeding. Buckets. Just buckets of blood. Oh, kick to the head by Punk to Big Show. Punk fights up a double team. Uh, headbutt to Punk. Pump handle slam by Big Show on Cena. Fisherman Buster. Back into the nope. Cena doesn't go back into the ring. He hits off the apron and falls. Go to sleep on Show. Go to sleep on Show. Go to sleep on Show. Cena exits the ring again after taking a breather in the inside. Body slams Puck. Double axe handle show. He's put in again. Puck's taking a breather. Show. Show getting into the ring. Cena getting into. Cena taking a breather as well. Uh. Big knee to the face from Punk. Punk's got two people to worry about. Tiger suplex rope break. Down goes Cena. Runs into the big show. Punk and Big Show meet and collide. Both men go down somehow. Uh-oh. 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 Save him! Save him, Punk! Save him! Punk doesn't save Cena, obviously, somehow. Amazing. Punk being backed up on his head. Punk in showdown. Cena going after Big Show and his fat. Big Show kicks both men off. Big Show going after Cena now. Cena putting Big Show into the. Both Big Show and Cena are down. Snap suplex on Cena. Big Show. Punk bumped this show again. I don't really know anymore because Cena's just there. Oh, there it. I'm not gonna play WCW Nitro. I can't. I can't play that. I just can't. Kick to the head. Ref bump! Big Show kills the ref! The ref is dead! 
The ref is dead. He's twitching on the crown dead. Oh, tries to elbow drop on Cena's head. Cena moves out of the way. Try to kill Cena with an elbow drop. Uh, I can't run a PlayStation 2 emulator because it doesn't work. I mean, it does work, but it's slow. So, anything's gonna be slow on it. Boom! Kick to the head. Double suplex. And... Fisherman Buster. And I don't want to play the portable game of Legends of Wrestling 2 because it's terrible. So that pretty much shows you. Chokeslam! Down goes Cena. Big show with the pin. Punk, stand there! Punk! Punk! Oh, why did you just stand there, Punk? Big show almost won! Big show almost won! Big show almost won! Chokes on the Cena again! Punk, you gotta do something! I would drop Cena and show, show is dazed and confused and breathing hard and everything like that. Cena, oh, Punk wanted to show again for like the fifth time. Punk bent down. I don't, I don't know if this can keep going. I don't know how much longer this can keep going. It's great. Cena takes out show. Punk. Ooh, Dex, Cena, show. Kill punch on Cena! Kill punch on Punk! He's pin someone! Pin someone! You got a pin! Oh, why did you pin someone, Joe? Jeez, freaking crap! Punk and punch on Cena! Pin somebody! Pin fuck somebody! God damn it, Joe! Show you what are you what are you doing? It's not time to eat Ryback's food. <laughs> punch on Punk! Punch on Cena! No! Ah! God dang! Cena obviously. You know, confused right now. Punk is is a punch on Punk. Punch on Cena. Punch on Cena. Come on. I'll pin someone. Ah, oh, come on. What show? What the hell? Show has no idea what to do. He doesn't. He doesn't. He thinks it's a ladder match. Shows in the corner. Punches Punk. Punk goes down. Shows taking a breather. Not go for the pin. Here comes Cena, here comes Punk. Cena gets knocked down, Punk's just waiting. Punk goes for Show, uh, Show kicks the hell out of Punk. And let's Punk back up, here comes Cena, Cena, Cena and Punk, I mean Cena with a freaking fame asser. Show gets put in the turnbuckle. Punk kick though to Cena, back kick. And GTS to Show. Dragging away, Show. Pin by- nope! Out of the ring. Body slam by show! Show! What are you doing? What are you doing, show? We're almost at the 30 minute mark here. For a triple- for a triple threat match. Punk almost runs the show for the sixth time. Show's taking a breather again. Uh oh. Oh no. This could be bad. Show, watch out. Watch out. Run off the top. Wow, I thought I was going to go to sleep off the top for some odd reason. Dean Malenko's fault. Schoolboy. Big show. To the ropes. Go to sleep on Cena. Gets killed by Big Show. God, triple threat matches are long in Fire Pro. Down goes Punk. Big Show's out of the ring now. Try to wait for Rogue's a pin. Pin him. Pin him. This is the opportunity that you waited for, Punk. You're not going to do it, are you? No. Punk 
Punk is gonna get in the ring with Cena. Gonna slam down. I mean, Choke slams down Punk. Sl knocks over Cena. Uh, KO punch? No, Punk's gonna get Big Show in the corner now, and then get knocked down by Cena. I have no idea what's going on anymore. <laughs> Elbows down, Punk. Uh, back, no. Uh, Lariat misses Cena. Show with the headbutt on Cena. Body slam on Punk. The referee's down on one knee. He's T-bowing. The ref is T-bowing. The ref is T-bowing. STF on Punk. <laughs> Punk Show breaks it up just in time to stop Cena from winning this match. Double axe handle. Oh no. F you! Punk, kick him off! Kick him off without anything! Punk, just what the Punk, what'd you do? What'd you do? What did you do? Punk just stand there and like, screw this match. I don't want to be part of it anymore. See if they can go win. I don't care. What the hell? Troll. Jero troll. Talk about freaking Cena troll. Okay. One more match left, and then we're done with the SummerSlam, you know, simulation. Probably going to be the first match, so I hope everyone enjoys. You all ready for help shit hit the fan? Because shit is going to hit the fan. Here you go. Your main event of the SummerSlam simulation. Yep, three minutes. This is as long as it's going to take, hopefully. We're going to find out. Triple H versus Brock Lesnar. Dun 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 Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Deathmatch time! Say hello to exploding deathmatch time! Yay! Blood wire! Body slam on a chair! Body slam on the ring! Suplexed! The wax handle. I will to the face. Body slam to Brock, and this is going slow. This is the slowest match I've ever seen. Body slam to Triple H. Boom! Triple H blows up. He's dead. Game over. Triple H is busted open. And Lesnar goes right into light tubes. And Triple H gets Brack record. And elbowed up. Whoa. No explosions. No explosions from Triple H that time. He just got elbowed over the top rope. Lucky. Lucky bastard. Bobby son to Lesnar. Bobby son to Lesnar again. More stomps from Triple H. Elbow to the face. Knee to the gut. Double to the back of the head. Am I a good commentator yet? Triple H goes into light tubes. Lesnar goes into the light tubes. This is your death match of the night. No, this is it. Larry Fi. Triple H. Suplex. There goes Lesnar. Boom! There goes Lesnar getting exploded. Lesnar's now busted open. No, everybody's bleeding. Except the ref. I did a great job. Punches to the gut and the knees to the gut. Don't you dare predict partway through a match based on who's bleeding and who's not because technically that will never work because everybody will be bleeding in this match. Most likely. The weapons have yet to come into play. Bury the belly suplex in the middle of the ring. Triple H charges through Lesnar. Chop block. 
You know who really wins? No one. One count only. Expo explosions and he only he gets hit by explosions only still in one count. That's a perfect move. Triple H submission. Cole Hayden wins because he makes millions of dollars and doesn't get wrestled. Do anything. Big knee to the face. Submissions. There are no explosions this match. It's only landmines. If you get thrown to the outside, it's explosion. Yeah, this is more the type of death match I see them doing because uh I can't do the other one. I don't think they'd ever have a big explosion ring. Ooh, bulldog onto the chair. Bulldog onto the chair. Triple H was like, "Low, bulldog onto the table piece. Bulldog onto the table piece." Double X handle. Down goes Lesnar. Oh, well, Triple H had a sledgehammer for a second. Pulled out onto nothing. That would have been on the sledgehammer if you didn't move it. Six inches. Punches by Triple H. Pick up Triple H again. Big running jumping knee. And Lesnar's like backbreaker. And then trying to make Triple H step out. Why did I put rope breaks on? Uh, why are rope breaks even on in a death match? Anyway, here you go. Pedigree. Rope break. Wow. Good fall by Lesnar. A one count by on, on Lesnar. On um, Triple H by Lesnar. Triple H. Give me the suck it movement. Great. Not a really super, but it's a really side slam. Never mind. I thought I was gonna toss him out of the ring from there. Damn it, Lesnar! Do it right. Knees to the gut. Down goes Triple H. Dun 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 dun. Elbow to the face. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. That's fine, Buster. No, nope. it's fine, Buster. Whoa. It looked wrong though. Knees to the gut. Okay. Spear. Lesnar for spear. Spear by Lesnar. Spear. 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 For edge. He needs to go again. I don't think Lesnar likes Triple H much. Submission. You know, Brock, Brock hasn't hit an F5 yet. <laughs> oh, Lesnar gets thrown to the outside, but not far enough for explosions. Yes. Overhead belly to belly suplex. Triple H missing the chair by about a foot. Shorter block. Lesnar falls back on the chair. Big knee. Lesnar falls on the chair again. Triple H is all like... Bulldog! No. Not on the chair. Chop. Lesnar goes down like a ton of bricks. Lesnar has not went for the F5 yet. Elbow by Triple H. Knees to the gut by Lesnar. More submissions by Lesnar. Less, less MMA Lesnar, more wrestling Lesnar. Close line. Body slam to Lesnar. And is it time for the pedigree? Nope, no pedigree. Is it time for the F5? No F5. Oh, it's time for a power bomb combination. One. Two. Three. Three power bombs. Falls line. 
Hold on my Triple H. Pedigree! One! Two! Two counts only. Lesnar only sells two counts. Tosses him up and over. Side slam. Here we go! F5 on the chair! F5 on the chair! Pinfall on the up to the F5 on the chair. One, two, two point nine, no. Voyage basically no sells the F5 on the chair. Back body drop. Suck it. And then knee to the gut. Wow. Boom! There goes Triple H. F5 again! This time not on anything. Here by Lesnar. Elbow to the face of Lesnar. Down goes and Triple H has it now. Double axe handle. Submission. Triple H taps. Triple H taps. Fair hugging. Triple H taps. Well. Game over. The bear hug wins it for Lesnar. And that is the end of the Summer Slam simulation. Next up, I do my implosion uh, qualifiers. So I'm going to cut caps and then be right back.